Hey everyone, today I'm going to tell you what a fruit is, botanically speaking. Let's botanize. Colloquially, we use the term fruit exclusively to describe sweet, fleshy fruits like this blueberry. However, this is only a narrow breadth of the vast diversity of fruits across flowering plants. So let's take a step back and ask what a fruit actually is. In the simplest form, a fruit is a modified leaf that's wrapped around the developing seed. We know that this is the case from developmental work as well as from the fossil record. If we look back in time, we see that some of the earliest seed plants produce seeds on the bottoms of unmodified leaves. Over geologic time, these heavily modified seed-bearing leaves, which we call carpels, have evolved a variety of different structural and functional traits, leading to the diversity of fruits that we see today. In many cases, several carpels will fuse to form the final fruit structure, for instance, in the slices of an orange. In other cases, the carpels, or the fruit, will fuse with other floral organs, like in the apple where the base of the flower engulfs the carpels, forming the fleshy part that you eat. The uniting function across all of this fruit diversity is the dual role of protecting the developing seeds and, once they're mature, assisting with their dispersal, usually through animal vectors or by the wind. Or by the wind. or by wind. <laughs>